how to edit your text in Canva. Now, every piece of text in your template is editable. So every single text box we can click on and we can edit that text. So we can change what it says. We can change the font and we can change the color of the font as well. We can change the size. We can change the location. Everything is customizable. So what I would do is if I wanted to change the name of this gift guide is I would, I would come and hover over with my mouse and I would double click. What that'll do is it'll open up that text box and now I have a blinking cursor sitting there. So I can use my keyboard and I can change it to uh, whatever I want it to say. Now, if that was too long, see how now our text doesn't quite fit within that arch. What I can do is a couple of things. I can either highlight the text here and use the text size box up on the left and use the little minus, or I can simply grab one of these little corner anchors and drag it in. So now that we have the text the right size, it's not in the right location. So again, there's a couple of ways we can do this. We can either use position. So up in position here, we've got this position which is center. So that's going to center the text on the page there. Otherwise, we can move it around manually. So to do that, we would need to click outside of that text box so that we're no longer in the editing mode. And then we would click once on there. So see the difference? If we want to edit what it says, we double click. If we want to move it, it's a single click. So now we've done a single click and then I'm going to hold my finger down on the mouse and I can move it around. Now Canva's really helpful. It will pop these guides up and so it will align things with di different elements on the page. So I can see where those lines are. That's now in the very center of the page and the bottom of that box is sitting on the middle of the page, you know, vertically. I can move it down further. I can maybe align it with the top of the arch. You know, there's lots of different ways that we could position that. But I'm going to leave it where it is, just centered there. Now the next thing is the font. So you might want to edit the template so that it is consistent with your brand, your look and feel. So again, we're just going to click on that box, just a single click. We're going to come up to the font selector, selector here, and that's going to drop down. If we know the name of the font we want to use, we would type it in, or we can scroll through. Now, there are so many fonts in here. You could spend all day looking at fonts. Uh, just a quick note, if you are using the free version of Canva, the fonts that have the little crown next to them, you will have to pay to use those. So if you're on the free plan, stick to the fonts that don't have the little crown there. But I might select uh, this font here looks quite nice. Let's click on that one there. Now, we have edited that font for... Um, that piece of text. Now we get this option here. So down the bottom on the left, it's saying, do you want to change that font all the way through the document? So wherever it has that original font, which was called Tina Sands, we can change that now with just the click of a button. So when I click that, it's going to work its way right throughout that whole document. And we can now see all of the heading fonts are changed. So it's really simple. You really can't get it wrong. Dive in, have a play around, change the font style. Um, one other thing you can do is change the color as well. I didn't mention that. So again, it's a, let's click somewhere out of there. It's a single click on the uh, section of text you want to change and then we have this A with the rainbow so we're going to click on that that's our text color so what we've got here at the top is it's pulling out all of the document colors so it's pulling out all of the colors that are featured in this document which we can use we can pick from these default colors down the bottom here or if we know our own brand color so I know that my um, one of my brand colors is 1F577F and that's going to pull through that dark blue. So that's one of my brand colors. And again, if I were to click on that, down the bottom, we get to change all. So originally the text was black. I've changed it to the dark blue. And it's now, Canva's now asking me if I want to change every instance of that black in the document to my dark blue. So I click change all and it's going to work its way through the document. We can now see all of that text has changed to a dark blue. Let me know if you have any questions, but dive in, have a play around and really make the template your own.